What's up everyone, Drew here. Today we're going to be showing you guys on how to jailbreak iOS 5.1 Tethered. Now this is a Tethered jailbreak and the following devices this jailbreak will work for iOS 5.1 Tethered is the iPhone 4 and the iPad 1. The following devices that this jailbreak will not work for is the iPhone 4S and the iPad 2. Now if you guys are on iOS 5.0.1 and jailbroken on the iPhone 4S and the iPad 2, definitely make sure you guys stay on those firmwares in case you do not want to lose your jailbreak so really there's nothing too new with iOS 5.1 it just adds some new camera features but other than that it's pretty much nothing new so definitely make sure you guys stay on iOS 5.0.1 I cannot stress that enough so you're simply going to come here to the Death Teams blog and simply download Red Snow for Mac or Windows so this is available for Mac or Windows all you simply have to do is just come here we are actually on a Mac so all you simply have to do is just click on that it opens up the download page all you simply got to do is click here to download and then simply save it to your desktop so let's go ahead and jump over to the desktop and simply start jailbreaking our devices all right guys before we go ahead and jailbreak our device i do want to show you guys that my iphone 4 is on ios 5.1 so right here is my iphone 4 so let's simply go ahead and show you so let's go ahead and simply slide to unlock let's go ahead and go into settings let's go into general and about and right there is version 5.1 as you guys can see i just did a freshly restore there is no applications on my device or any Cydia. This is a brand new restore. So now let's go ahead and open up Red Snow here. So let's go ahead and open up that. And then here it says welcome to Red Snow. And here you get jailbreak and extras. And then it says connected iPhone 4 and iOS 5.1. So let's simply go ahead and hit jailbreak. And here it says welcome once again. Then it says iPhone 4S and iPad 2. It's basically telling you if those devices are plugged in, simply unplug them because this jailbreak will not work. And here it's telling you guys you want to make sure your device is plugged into your computer as you guys can see. And it's going to go ahead and tell you to put your device into DFU mode. I am going to show you guys on how to put your device into DFU mode. It's very simple. And if you guys just mess up, simply unplug your device from your computer. Then simply plug it back in. Then run the program once again. Then you should be good to go. Alright. So let's go and simply begin to jailbreak our device. To actually get your device into DFE mode, all you simply have to do is just hold down the power button as well as the home button. You gotta wait until the slide to power off simply comes up, then hold down the home button. So let's go ahead and simply slide power off. Then hold down the home button. Hold them both together. Do not let go. And then go ahead and let go of the home button and keep holding the home button. And then we should see exploiting with Lime Rain. That is excellent. And just go ahead and keep holding that home button. I'm just going to go ahead and wait for reboot, and that is a good thing. And it's rebooting. And you guys see the text right here. That is a good. And you guys are pretty much done. So let's simply go ahead and slide to unlock. And let's scroll over. And as you guys can see, we do have Cydia, but the icon is white. That is because this is a tethered boot. So we are simply going to go ahead and have to redo the jailbreak again. So let's go ahead and simply go back. And let's go back once again. And you want to go ahead and simply go into extras here. So just click on extras. And then you just simply want to do just boot tethered. And just go ahead and tell you to please make sure your device is plugged off and plugged into the computer. So now what you want to do is just go ahead and run these same steps over again as we did. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, so now let's simply go ahead and slide to unlock. Scroll on over, and as you guys can see, the white con is no longer white. Let's go ahead and go into Cydia. And all you simply have to do is go ahead and make sure your Wi-Fi is connected. Go ahead and click on user, press done, and then simply let all that update. And then there you guys go. You should have Cydia on iOS 5.1 on the iPhone 4 and the iPad 1. So that's pretty much it, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Get to make sure to subscribe right there for all your daily jailbreak videos. Give this video a thumbs up. Drop all of your comments down below. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter. All those links are down below in the video description. Until the next video, guys, we'll see you guys in the next one.